Kativa obtained more than 3,600 votes, with Swapo's Nehemia Solomon coming in the second position, receiving just over 3,100 of the votes cast. The Landless People's Movement candidate Tangeni Musheko came third with over 1,300 votes, while the rest of the five candidates scored below 1,000 votes each. The IPC candidate, who is also the current mayor of Swakipmund, has welcomed the results. Thank you very much for the multi got For those times when we were campaigning, it's because of the multi got so that we can make it. And I can thank you for my president, Dr. Bandulen Itula, who opened our eyes of the youth to say, Namibia is all we have, Namibia is not for sale, we shall save it. So I win the by-elections and I'm going to hold this office but under the theme which I can call love, care and faith. So therefore I'm just encouraging the community of Swakopman that Luisa Kativa will be in the original councillor now as a, a candidate and everybody the door is open to the people of Swakopman. Kativa will join other councillors on the Irongo Regional Council, where IPC and SWAPO both have three councillors and the United Democratic Front holds one seat. Out of the 37,000 registered voters, close to 10,000 people voted in the by-election. The exercise became necessary when IPC expelled former constituency councillor Siske Howard Smith from the party. Renate Rengura, NBC News, Swakopmund.